Good morning, everyone. It's day one. We woke up, slept, slept okay, to be fair. I think Jax was up at half four, went back to sleep. Elliot was up at four, did not go back to sleep. So then, Jack's woke up about six. We were awake obviously since about four. And yeah, we got a little knock this morning saying that there'd been a noise complaint about us, which instantly put like a dampener on the holiday, I've got to say. They've not been overly loud or anything. And we heard this room knock, so we knew it was there. We just went down, it instantly like put us in a bad mood. That was about seven o'clock. We got this knock on the door and then we went down saying basically, you know, that they're, they're talking, they're not being overly loud, they're just being children. And she was like, just to let you know, that room is moving. So obviously we know, like, it's come from them. She didn't say it. So she was like, do you want to move rooms? Because um, we've got an interlocking door as well. We've said, like, we'll stay here. If there's an issue, then we'll look at moving. We, we think it is that side, which have gone now. Yeah, just put a bit of a dampener on it. But that is one thing I'd say if you're coming with children. Just be aware that endless summer resort rooms, we're in the dock side. Um, they're so thin. Like, I could hear those talking last night whether they were getting a shower or not. So they're really thin. We're on edge now. Like, if they even talk loud, like, be quiet, you know, you've got to keep it down. I've never had that before in a hotel. Just to make you aware, oh, little, little bugs just landed there. <laughs> Having a little chill on the window. But today we've decided we're going to go to Volcano Bay. It's a glorious day. So absolutely beautiful blue skies. It's already like 30 degrees. We're just watching the buses come in because Elliot and Jack just love the, bu the buses coming here. Elliot wants to go on the bendy bus, which is obviously the volcano bus. So we've not been there yet, obviously. It's day one. So we're gonna head out. We've just had our breakfast. These little granola bowls we've been getting from downstairs. We get two for $11, which is not bad at all. And then we've obviously been getting a Starbucks coffee. I've got my little boy's name on. Just to show you my little outfit. So I've got this swim cozy on because we're going swimming. Um, from our sauce, it's just like a really low backless one. And then these jeans are from, I think they're from Zara. to get you on the rides so you just literally like touch it onto the little thing gonna go on the apple coaster Volcano Bay. It's amazing weather as well, so we're made up. I'm just going to take Elliot for a wee and Rob's going. 
going to rent a locker. How much is it, Rob? So you, I think you use the tappy tappy to open everything. Also forgot to mention that you can actually like upload your credit card onto that. So you can pay for like dinner, um, any souvenirs, snacks and stuff with your tappy tappy. You just like literally tap it in as if you're paying with a credit card or anything and you upload your information. So that's a handy feature so you don't actually need to carry like your money around with you in a wallet or anything. But we're just going to get like a little waterproof wallet now. Um, how much would it be? Ten, ten dollars? Yeah. For like a little pouch um, that you can put your phone in, put your money in and just keeps everything dry and the tickets and stuff. And then we won't need to bother with a locker because we just literally carry, carry everything around with us. So you just tap in like that and it's sixteen dollars to rent a locker. Um, so you just literally tap your tap your tap it on there and then it just comes up purchase. <laughs> Yeah, it's really long. 
Mm -hmm. So that'll be up soon. That's going to be up soon. I'm going to ride that. Yeah. Just got a jumbo bamboo kitchen now. It's gone for the bamboo burger. That is £16.49. Got some kids, some chicken tenders, some chips. Can you, can you Drop, first drop. You see someone come down it? They've just been on it though, they are on the way. What? They've just been on it. Oh, there they go. Must be working. You know what this is called? Daddy? Daddy, you know what this is called? A lazy river. A lazy river, Daddy. Yeah. Is it waterproof? Because it doesn't blow. Huh? Yeah, I just want to dip it in. And who's the laziest? Well, really, that is his experience. Who is? Who's the laziest? Mummy! Oh, really? Me, yeah. Nothing in the toilet, but still I had to put my hand out and get that back. So thanks Elliot. Um, but we're just gonna enjoy it now. Lovely weather and it's quite breezy as well, so it's like cooling it down a bit. So we're just gonna jack success with the Apple Coaster, the Cracker Tower. So we've already tapped into that. That's an hour and a half, uh, an hour 130 minutes. So just over two hours. Um, so we're gonna wait for that to come up. We're gonna go in the baby bit because Elliot is obsessed with the orange slide in the baby bit and just do the pool and stuff. So we can enjoy our day. I love it here at Volcano Bay. We're just really looking forward to a chill day. It's busy, but it doesn't really matter because you don't wait in line for anything anyway. We're just gonna go on a little adventure now through the Volcano Bridge, aren't we, Jack? So we think it's this way, but we're not too sure. So I get lost. I the other slides built into the volcano, green and blue one. And high noon, and it's on the drop slides. 
six foot drop, it's a four foot drop. I think that's the one, babe. Which one is that? Jax wants to do the green and the blue side at the top of the volcano, so we're going to see if he's actually big enough. Yeah, we've had a really good day and it's one of my favourite water parks, Volcano Bay, I absolutely love it. Um, and they don't rip you off for lockers like Aquatica does, so yeah, we had a good day. We got we went to the outlets quickly and got these croc sandals because my feet were hurting and honestly, they are the most comfiest, amazing thing ever. And I got these giblets, the kids got some as well, I'll show you those, but got these giblets, they were like five dollars each for the giblets and it was buy 13 get 13 free, so that's what we did, but it cost us, it literally cost us 200 dollars for these crocs. Gibbets! Gibbets! <laughs> we got these gibbets, I've been calling them giblets, but Rob says the gibbets. These are Elliot's ones, which he's just obsessed with, um, with all the gibbets on. And then these are Jacks, which are really cool. Mario, Yoshi. Um, and then obviously he's got Jeff Jackson, F. Elliot, so pretty cool. All those, and Rob got a few gibbets for his ones back home, but he's not wearing them out here. <coughs> so there's the family little crop. These sandals, honestly, I think it's the, the sole of them. They are so comfy. And I've got a blister on my, like, my little toe from walking around. And they've just been the comfiest thing with that. So that's what we got from there. Um, just because we were trying to stay up a bit later. Rob's just come out of the bathroom. Are you getting ready? Yeah. I'm going to go. Um, yeah, I'm so. Not, I'm just going to get my giblets on. <laughs> <laughs> right. Gibbets. Yeah. Why do they make them so close to giblets? Yeah. 